G'day guys and welcome to Medieval Mayhem on this channel. You'll find lots of videos into the whole medieval period. You'll find reviews into other people's gear. You'll find crafting videos into making your own costumes. You'll find DIY videos into making your own furniture. You'll find how-to videos into all sorts of medieval camping and that kind of thing. We do videos for, we analyze historical events, what happened, who were the key players, and why did things turn out the way that they did. So if medieval is your thing, this is the channel for you, and you might want to consider subscribing. Alrighty, so this is the running bowline knot. So the first thing we're going to do, now I like to use a really good quality natural fibre rope. You'll find the fibres actually work against each other and hold the knot in place far better than a lot of the modern cotton ropes or the synthetics like uh, the different plastic ropes and so on. So that's my suggestion and that's what we're using today. Okay, pass the rope over the branch or whatever it is we're trying to put a knot against. Give yourself a bit of slack, you don't need to um, be skimpy here. Okay, we're now going to make a bend in the cord. Ready? Right, okay, we now take the short end, we pass it back behind, we go uh, up through, behind, okay, just adjust as we go through, now that will make a normal bowline knot, okay. And now you have a running bowline knot. Pretty simple, pretty effective, and I really like that. I think that's a, a really solid knot. Very easy to do. I think it's so important to be able to tie good quality knots when we're at medieval and camping events. It just shows that we take that much more care and pride in our work and our uh, presentation and I think that's really important to show people who are there to visit because uh, these sorts of events are really all about uh, our pride and our, um, our passion for our interests. There we go. So there we go guys. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Please like, subscribe and share and I will catch you in my next video.